be in the same direction as n. So when we do a dot product of t and n, that means a projection of t and on the direction of n. And on the direction of n, if that's perpendicular to the plane, that's going to give us the normal stress, sigma n. And it's this mathematical operation. And if we want to compute what is the value of the shear stress, what I'm going to have to do is to subtract the value of the magnitude of t. Uh, and this is going to be, uh, that's going to be the square. t squared minus sigma n squared. This is just Pythagoras, right? Uh, where this is going to be the long side, and these are going to be the other two sides. Um, so we're going to stop here because we're going to leave it over the time. Uh, but on uh, Wednesday, we'll see how we apply a little more physical meaning to these equations. So we convert this in terms of deep and stuff. All right? Okay, see you on Wednesday.